Hold on. Okay. Hello, YouTube and all my fans. I just got this one in. This is a audio pipe. Mm. It's an APHD slash 3001 slash FI. One ohms. 3000 watt. This is a little mini amplifier. It's not that big. Just like the Taram. But get, these are made of a copy of the Brazilian. And this is the copy of the... I would say the sound digital, yeah. Copy of the sound digital because I do a bunch of them and yeah. Definitely the same circuit board and all that stuff, you know? Yeah. And stuff like that. And use a capacitor here, it says uh, what? 120 volts, 3300 microfarad. And carry the fan right here just like the sound digital. Mainly everything is just a copy, you know? so the problem was with this I repaired it already but I didn't get to video it because I was just moving fast and I said you know I'm gonna go back and just you know explain to you guys exactly what I did okay so what I did is adjust this a little bit more it was the outputs the guy he said it, it smoke up a sub he has you know the overdrive it and he smoke the sub and then this goes into clip not protection it goes into clip but Eventually, this should go into protection due to the problem that it was it had because it was the output the output MOSFET so this used the output MOSFET and it used just like the I see the sound digital use it and um, the sound down yeah, the sound down they use it too they use the same output which the part number is H is H6 H6 so a lot of people I know they wouldn't, you wouldn't get this too hard to buy that you know they wouldn't give this to you, you know they wouldn't do that and the problem is so I figured out from a long time since I've been the first one I work on is the sound digital one of them I don't remember which one exactly but the problem was with it it was the it was the output same way and it was a problem for me to find a replacement for it So, so the replacement, I get to find out what worked really for, perfectly for it is the IRF B4115. That output, yeah, it's a 200 volt, so it worked real, it worked perfectly for it. So, you know, if you have one of these and you know, if you ever have one of these and you know, the output must be our shot, yeah, definitely, yeah, you can use that for the replacement for it and stuff like that and you know you'll be okay you run comfortably do nothing it's not, don't overheat nothing like that let me check I didn't check the power supply MOSFET I don't remember what they use for the, oh yeah power supply MOSFET is H1 H1 and that I wouldn't worry about because I replaced these with the same one that the Taramp use and that's the IRF 1404 and those stuff, yeah, they use, yeah, I use those before they were comfortable, so, you know, but, you know, but now I'm going to give this a little bench test and see if everything is okay, which I poured it up early already, but I never, I don't know if it's playing good or anything like that, I didn't bench test it as yet, so, now I'm going to give it a little bench test and see if everything is okay with it and then, you know, move on from there so that would be a su successful repair so give me a minute all right let me put this right here all right and for bench testing i know you guys want to see when i'm adjusting the knobs and stuff like that to make sure everything's okay and oh perfect the speaker wires are see that guys speaker wires are right here so no i can definitely oh 
it's gonna be the same. You see it has four terminal but guys it's connected to the same inside so don't worry about that. Yeah I use the normal do I use one at the far end and the other one the far so, right. oh man these can be a problem these wires no lifting the this thing wow yeah those can be a real problem I get on before we a bunch of them shot it out a hundred Guys are seeing me, seeing what I'm doing here yeah, clearly. Yep. This is okay. I don't remember if I said it before. This is CNC Electronics, Carty and Carty, sales and repair. You know, we do amplifier repair. We do we sell amplifiers. We do our you know the whole yard repair, subwoofers, and all that stuff. PA system, yeah, installation, but I don't get around to do a lot of installation as yet, you know, unless I have some good time off because, you know, everything now is like not that easy to do all that kind of stuff. All right. Just because I have a full time job, guys, I don't get to make a lot of videos, so please bear with me. I have a lot of good stuff coming, you know. A lot of stuff to teach you guys so to make voice call and all that stuff which I don't get around to as yet because you know most of you guys doing it is like in Spanish the guys in Spanish guys are doing a lot of that you know but I'm here I can do it I'll, you know but I don't get around to do it so I'll let you guys know when I do you know you'll see the videos and all that stuff This now, pour it on. Play a song or no? I'm not gonna play a song instrumental. Guys, so you can oh yeah, it's poured on. Cord up, you could see the light right there. Alright, and then I'm gonna play. Okay, guys. 
Okay, guys, so that's it for the bench test of this amplifier. This is CNC Electronics, Sales and Repairs. My name is Norton, and that's what I have for you for today, guys. I have other amplifiers, so I'll make the video you guys will see. I have a lot of videos coming up, but you know, I don't get around to do it because of my job. As I said, you know, I don't get enough time to make videos and stuff like that, you know. So, as soon as I do, I'll let you guys know. So that's it for today and thank you guys please hit the bell icon subscribe and like and share to your friends okay guys thank you i really appreciate it man thank you very much i have a lot of stuff to teach you guys you know and stuff so just please you know keep the comments coming and uh, thumbs up you know hit the bell icon and everything like that you know all the good stuff you know just just do what you're supposed to do do the right thing as they say you know and then you know i can share a lot of stuff with you and you can share a lot of stuff with me too so you know that's how it goes that's how the world works you know and thank you again guys i really appreciate you know everybody who watch my channel and stuff like that and you know and everything so thank you again i can't thank you guys enough so you know just let me know any questions let me know any comments and stuff like that thank you hold on